Yeah, let's leave. Okay, what are the options? We've got this here. And we might get some stuff, which would be good. It doesn't use too much energy, so let's go up and see what the situation is. Hopefully, it's not a bad one. You spot a deer stand between two skeletal trees just ahead of you. As you consider walking over to the deer stand to search for provisions, you hear a rumbling. It sounds like an avalanche. You see the snow cloud on the horizon. It's heading straight for you. Oh, I want to search. Minus 17 on energy. We could go back to the cave if we need to. Yeah, we're searching. As you rush to the deer stand, the rumbling of the avalanche, whatever, to a deafening volume. The second you reach your destination, the avalanche slams into the, you and carries you off. When you finally manage to dig yourself free from the mass of snow, your whole body is shaking and the cold is unbearable, but you can't stay here. Okay, so we are a little bit cold. That's fine. Um, let's see. Where was the... Ah, oh, I don't think we can go back. I think the ones you visit, you don't get to go to again. Uh oh. Um, we probably better have something to help us out then just for some energy. Oh. Okay. Right. That uses quite a lot. That's, oh, no. Yep, let's go to this one. I don't think we've been to this one. I'm just hoping we're going to get to a cave soon. I'm not seeing a cave. So for this video, I will do I will do like the whole mountain, but I'll probably just do it in a couple of episodes. Okay, there's an active fire pit, but the not a sod is around. Oh, have we been to this one? Sanity or energy? Uh, energy. That's quite good, actually. So, we're heading in the right direction. Let's, I guess we're just going to carry on. We've got some goodies here. It's not using too much energy, really, if you think about it. And I just wanted to see if we can spot a cave. I, mean, I could have gone there as well. Oh, well. We'll skip that for the minute. Oh no, no, it's night. I wonder if we can use our tent. I wonder if they're one, once used tents. You trudge along a slope piled high with snow. You sink deeper into the drifts with every step until suddenly your boot meets resistance. You push the snow aside, exposing a metal surface with covered markings on it. Faded but still identifiable. There's no doubt about it. You found the wing of a downed aeroplane. Uh, dig deeper. Wow, that uses a lot of energy, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> you dig and dig until you uncover the cockpit. The glass is shattered. So you make extra care as you lean through the hole of the windshield. There's no trace of a pilot or any human remains, but you do find some provisions. It's remarkable that they have survived the crash without a scratch. Oh, we got some tea. Maybe we'll have some hot tea. Um, we're not super cold yet. Maybe we'll 
can do it when we actually need it. Oh, look, I've got some... Um... Oh, we can use herbs. I could have got those. Okay, so what do we need? Gain energy when waking up. Early sleeper. We haven't got any of the herbs, so let's go for this one. Okay, so we are super tired and I can't see a darn thing. Um, I wonder whether we can use the tent. Let's see if we can actually use it. So use tent, tent durability. Um, I think we'll have a long sleep and we should wake up just before morning. Hopefully we'll get a boost to that energy thing. I don't know if we did. Right, so now we've got a bit of a climb. Oh, sorry guys. Uh, we're still going in the kind of right direction. We've got some bigger climbs coming up. Very rocky here, isn't it? Uh-oh. Snow beneath, your feet gives away, you fall. But not far, you land at the bottom of a flat, snowy crevice. Should we have some tea? Oh, that's warmed us up lovely. Good, okay. Right. Oh, I wonder what the energy would use to get up to that bit. I can't see. That's a cave. There's a cave there. I don't want to miss anything, so let's go here. Oh no, cancel that. Because I don't want to miss any opportunities because you can't actually see the uh, the little icons like this. So now we can because it's daylight. <laughs> so yeah, is it worth going to the cave? I don't know now actually. Yeah, I think we'll carry on and then go up this way got an icy way up or a rocky way. I don't know if it's worth seeing boots instead because we're not on the ice are we? Let's use the boots I guess. I think I've selected them. Or are they always on? Actually I think they're always on there. That's okay. So, do we go to the cave or is it not worth it? We have to come back on ourselves. We could have a little sleep. That's not much energy. Yeah, let's go to the cave. And then we'll assess. Maybe just a little a little kip. Be quite good. We don't want to waste the whole day, do we? Why right, it's daylight. Ah, oh, oh, I'm not on the cave. There's the cave. Okay, enter a cave. Dry shelter from the wind. Shimmer of light. Let's go have a look. You follow the light as you approach. You realise it's coming from 105. Fascinating, okay. Um, lie down and sleep. Let's go for a brief sleep. Is that brief, is it? What's a long sleep? Yeah, so we're going to lose minus 12 body temperature, but gain 24 energy. That'll do, just to keep us going, I think. So let's head. We're going to have to go this way. 
And then we've got some big climbs coming up, so I'm hoping there's going to be some cave there. If not, we'll just have to use the tent. I would definitely like to get up to the top. As you stand underneath the deformed skeleton of a tree, you look up and uh, stifle a scream at a parachute tangled in the treetop and dangling from its cords are the mortal remains of an unknown man. Climb the tree and take a look, pull the body down. Takes more time to do that. That's more risky and uses more energy. That uses the same and that's temperature. Oh temperature. It will, we'll go with that. The dead man is wearing a uniform, military. Did he die in the line of duty? Maybe he has family waiting for him. You are overwhelmed with grief, grief and shame because the dead soldier is carrying supplies you desperately need. You dismiss your pangs of guilt and tuck his equipment into your pocket. What's that? Oxygen mask. Oh, nice. That would be good when we get up to the higher areas, I guess. So, yeah, we'll have that. Is that all you had? Okay. Oh, we have level up, le uh, level up options. Steep climber. We are coming up to a bit of steep terrain at the moment. So, yeah, I think we'll go for that one. Okay. So let's have a look. We do have some steep climbs. Energy's not too bad. Temperature's not great. Yeah, let's go for that now. Oh, where am I? Can't go this way, can we? No. And then we'll just head up this way. Oh, now it's night time. Hopefully we'll be okay. We've got some tea. Oxygen. Okay. That's now chain. What was that before? I don't remember. Maybe it's always been there. I've just not noticed it. <laughs> okay. Here. Hmm. Yeah, let's go. I don't know if that was better going that way, to be honest. I need to look at more options of my routes because that, oh, maybe samey samey, but um, don't really, well, it's not too bad, is it? Let's just go here so we can see what's going on a bit better. I would like to go here. Oh, I am going there. Idiot. <laughs> I thought I only went up to here. Let's see what it is. An old woman sits in front of a crooked hut. She wears a friendly, toothless smile and motions you to sit with her to recharge your strength. You do as she suggests and regain health. My well, health's not great, is it? Warmth's not great either. either. Um, let's go warmth. I know our health's like not 100%, but our, uh, our warmth is getting a bit low. That's our, that is where we're supposed to be going. I don't actually know if I'll get to the top <laughs> in two episodes. Maybe I should just cut stuff out. That's quite a big climb there, isn't it? 
We're going to have to do it. I haven't got any other options. And then we'll check this out and maybe we need to think about having a rest or seeing if we can find a cave. The air is getting thin and your breath is heavy. You have entered the death zone. You pause for a moment to prepare for a difficult path towards the summit. I will ascend as quickly as possible. So that's decreased en energy cost for a short time. I'll take it slow. Decreased oxygen loss for a longer time. Maybe that's a quite a good one. Before I ascend, I will mend my wounds. That, uh, that might be a good idea. So we get our health back and sanity. So we've got the mask, haven't we? Yeah, let's go for that. Um, I don't know how long the mask lasts. Okay. There we go. Any level up options? Not yet. Okay, so let's go and have a look at this. I don't know which way we've got to go. I think I might be blocked. You see the outline of a large rectangular object concealed underneath an old parachute. You gingerly lift the stained, tethered, tattered fabric and find a metal case. Maybe it was used to transport goods. Oh yeah, we're going to search that. You're in luck. The case contains equipment. What's that? Heavy boots. Okay, so that's good for stone. Okay, we'll take the boots. I think I need to think about when I'm wearing the crampons and when I'm wearing boots. So let's just um, confirm that. We have a level up. First day, take some time to heal your wounds. We could do reduce time cost on all terrain. In a fire, gain more body temperature per hour when moving. I think we'll go with that. Okay. So, I don't know what that is there. Oh, that was me. Okay. Um, I don't think I can go this way. I have to come down. Okay. Um, yeah, no, we're not doing that, obviously. So, oh, we can go this way. Getting low on energy. Maybe we'll find a cave, so let's just come to here first so we get a better view. I didn't mean to do that. I don't know, there might be a cave hiding down here. What's that? No, I don't want to go down there. So we have rocky bits here, so we go to the backpack and change to the heavy boots they're better on stony areas okay oh our energy's going and our temperature's really low as well but I'm saying so it says hear a couple of loose stones rolling down the mountain. One of them hits you on the torso. Oh, I lost a bit of health. Right. There's a cave over there. Can I get to here? Yeah, we're going to lose energy because that's a big climb there. That 
let's go here first. There it is. You can go really steep. Look at these. Yeah, I may just do it in the hour. Um, I think we need to go to the cave. Was it better to go this way and then can I get down? Let's go here first. And then when we get up, if we make it to the cave, we'll check this out. And hopefully we'll start heading up. Well, look how cold I am. Yeah, let's um, let's get in the cave. Why? Well, I didn't actually tell you what they mean. Fingers crossed. I think it's because we're super, super tired. We're climbing down, so that's okay. You enter the cave, it's dry shut from the wind. You notice a strong smell. We're going to sleep. We'll have a long sleep. Not getting much um, warmth from that. I might need to see if I've got some more tea. Yeah, we are cold. Look at this. It's a bit of a climb. I could come round this way. Well, actually, it's not too bad. So let's have some tea. Warm us up a bit. And check this out. Look how cool that is. There it is, the summit. They look quite tall, don't they? To climb up. Steps have been hewn in the stone, leading you to a pedestal of sorts, some type of religious shrine. Maybe you're not particularly a spiritual person, but however, this place makes you feel holy. It might just be your imagination, but you pray to the shrine for, oh yes, energy. Because we're getting near the top now, we need as much energy as we can get. So we've got some ice bits coming here, so I think it's probably a good idea we change to crampons okay so I think which is the best way to go yeah so you could, I guess this is stone snow and then ice they should help us What's this one? Sprint. So we might as well use it because it's got a cool down. We have some stuffs here. Oh look, it's so close. That's crazy. I wonder if we can have a quick look around this way or is it going to go all weird on me? Actually, we've come quite a long way, haven't we? Definitely. Right, so there's anything good here. We've got our oxygen on, but oxygen's quite low, isn't it? You come across the remnants of a wall. A weathered stone wolf's head stares at you with lifeless eyes. Mm. Look how much energy that takes. No, we're not going to do that because we're closing in on the top. It's still quite a way though, because they're quite steep climbs, aren't they? So we've got a cave back there. We've got supplies. I wonder if it's worth going to supplies. It might be something decent. Because we're going to struggle with warmth and oxygen and all that jazz soon. So we could head over to this here. Did I see a cave icon? 
No, I didn't. Um. I think we should go and look for the supplies. Let's go here. I think maybe these are spiritual ones. I must say, it's a very relaxing game. I, I thought I'd be a bit more stressed. It's quite nice. I need a bit of no stress in my life right now as everyone does oh i didn't mean to go there oh well you discover a large leather saddlebag lying on the ground right next to it you discover faded hoof prints you find an intact tent in the saddlebag I haven't really got room for another tent, so how good is that? So let's get rid of that one and replace it with a decent one. Yep, that's fine. We're leaving that one. And we'll go check this out. Is that a cave? Yes, so we'll head to the cave, I think. Where are you going? No. What are you doing that for? I want you to go there. I don't know what I've done there. Just wasted the energy, I think. Oh no, it's night time. We're going to get cold. Let's see if we can go to here and then get to the cave. And then we'll hopefully we'll be to sleep for most of the night. Oxygen's a thing. Half buried in the ground you find a weathered stone plaque. It seems to be old, very old in fact. Stay and dig it up. Oh. Use a lot of energy. I don't think we'll have enough energy to get to the cave. Yeah, let's continue. That's a shame. I wanted to go there. The cave's up here. Yep, yeah, let's go. Yeah, I think we might have, we may have just made it to the cave, but it would have been uh, quite low on energy. It would be quite interesting to see the different difficulty levels when we start unlocking those. That would be quite good. But I don't know if this is a game that I could do like lots of episodes on. Do you know what I mean? Um, it really depends on what you guys think. So, if you're the guys I'm doing it for. And obviously myself, because I, you know, I love playing games. It's been a while since I've, um, I don't know. Just trying to get, like, stuff out that I'm interested in. I said there's three games I'm still waiting for. We've got Juggler's Tale, no date yet. Um, Away the Survival Series, no date yet. And Siberia. The, what was it well before or something I did the demo on it a couple of weeks back um, and that's sometime this year so <laughs> okay you enter the cave sheltered from the wind yes lie down and sleep take a long sleep takes us to early morning our oxygen whoa we're gonna need the energy though Hmm. 
Yeah, we're going to go for long. Let's have to hope and pray we've got enough, energy, uh, enough oxygen to get to the top. 